Hello everybody, welcome to Duff News. For this episode, we're gonna be starting off with our economy section. And for this economy section, we're gonna be talking about India specifically, which is ranked 47 out of 173 states. Now, this doesn't look completely good for India, but experts say it could be rising soon. Even though they've had three economic crises in the recent past, they're dedicating $200,000 in order to improve its infrastructure. And if that doesn't sound good enough, experts say it may even be becoming a first world country a little faster than we thought. Let's go to Dahlia with the news. Homelessness is an issue in Fresno and pretty much everywhere else. This Friday, September 29th, 2017, the Fresno Homeless no camping ordinance will be implemented and essentially what this does is essentially this allows police in Fresno to arrest anybody sleeping on public or private property and in addition to being arrested they will be held in jail for six months and fined $1,000 so in essence this makes homelessness illegal in Fresno and the Fresno Bee as well as, well as many other citizens of Fresno will be holding a protest camping out with tents and sleeping bags on the lawn of Fresno City Hall this Friday. Tuesday afternoon, a rapper Young Dolph was critically injured after a gunman opened fire outside of his hotel. LA authorities believe that the shootout may have been fueled by a hip-hop rivalry. The rapper was knocked to the ground after a fight, then being sh then shot multiple times. Soon after that, he was rushed over to a local hospital. Adolph Thornton, the rapper, is expected to recover well. For this section of trending news, I am sitting very far away from this table because I just heard something hiss at me. But anyways, we're focusing on B.O.B., the rapper, also known as Bobby Ray Simmons. Before we get into this, let me ask you, what shape do you think the Earth is? If you answered round, then you're wrong. Or at least according to B.O.B. He's got Neil deGrasse Tyson anguishing in his stupidity as he attempts to send satellites out into space using $200,000 in Kickstarter money to find out if the Earth is flat. He says, quote, I am looking for the curve. Meaning, I think he's a little bit open-minded, but let's see what other people have to say about this. What do you what do you think of rapper B.O.B. crowdfunding to find out if the Earth is flat? Okay, it's stupid. It's lit. So, Brenda, how do you feel about rapper B.O.B. raising funds to find out if the Earth is flat? Well, I think it's kind of stupid. Well, what do you think of it? I think it's kind of stupid. Sulfur, healthy for you, fame. Weight is good for you, and health is tall enough for you to be healthy. Out of the other corner comes cancer. They are bad for you, and they're probably short. Get a close up yeah. of your head. Are you ready? Broccoli is a cruciferous vegetable. Cruciferous vegetables like broccoli have cancer preventing and cancer suppressing substances. For instance, in broccoli, it's called sulforaphane. And according to a study done by the Journal of Nutritional Biochemistry in 2017, it is suggested that um, sulforaphane in um, broccoli protects and, and suppresses. Uh, prostate cancer, nutrients such as flavonoids and sulforaphane um, are better absorbed when cooked. And though you may just want to take a vitamin, nutrients such as these are better absorbed through the body um, through whole foods. So eat your veggies. University of Southern California's head basketball coach, Tony Bland, is being charged on federal charges committing bribery, soliciting bribery, and wire fraud. He was said to have taken bribes guiding two unnamed players to Christian Dawkins, an agent trying to secure and start his new firm. The arrests come out of a two-year-long investigation. 
and the evidence lies within video proof. Although the FBI says the investigation is far from over into the deep, murky waters of college basketball. That's all we've got for you guys today on Duff News. I hope you guys join us for next episode, and hopefully we're not canceled by then. See ya!